What's good everyone, it's Finn and back with more high-level StarCraft 2. This time we have two Canadian players, Masa and No Regret. No Regret is going gas first, so he's jumping right into things before I can even talk about his playstyle. <clears throat> he's in the bottom right of Abyssal Reef. Top left is Masa. As I take a sip of water there. So let's talk about these two players. Both of them are rather aggressive. Masa, especially when he's on land, will favor aggressive players. He's very good at drop harass. He's very good at these proxy builds. For instance, he's good at proxy racks marine and does it quite a bit on land. I've seen him do proxy racks marine so many times at different lands, whether it be at MLG or Dreamhack. And a lot of times you see Masa is capable of doing these quirky little old school like 1-1-1 type builds too. But he also has strong macro and I would say that he's definitely one of these Terrans who tries to play a bit like Maru. Tries to. Now the thing about Maru is he's just so talented and magical that getting anywhere near his micro is incredibly difficult to do. So a lot of players like to play like Maru but there's really only one Maru. Actually, I guess there's two Marus because Marine King Prime exists. <laughs> and the Terran will expand here, it appears. And the Lings are on the way for the Zerg player, so... No Regret is known as a very aggressive player, especially in ZBZ. I would say that out of all the professional gamers, No Regret is probably the most likely to do a Ling Bane all-in in every matchup across the board. And I have seen him do builds like this very often. And in ZBZ, I would say he favors almost exclusively aggressive play. And as a player, he's very cheesy. And whenever I play Terran and Protoss, I really hate to play cheesy Zergs because they're so hard to predict. And if you have your wall down, you can just lose the game. And we see Masa is trying to make an add-on here, but add-ons can't be repaired and it's going to be able to get DPS down. No Regret kills the Marine, or is going to kill the Marine easily. It was about to go hunt Ovis, and suddenly Moss's attempted factory is going to be thwarted, and this is really bad, as No Regret has Lings on the way, and Masa might just die here, as he did make the Reaper, but No Regret already has speed. Remember how absurdly early he took speed? Wow, and the Reaper got trapped next to a plant, and this factory has been halted, and Masa is so, so behind, is the most important structures here, can no longer produce, and he's going to pull SCVs here, he does not want to lose to this cheese, but he's probably going to, because this is not a wall, he was relying on an add-on, and see, this is why it sucks to lose to players like No Regret, as we see SCVs are going to fall here, because more Lings are going to scream into the base, the Terran player plummets below 10 supply, and he GG's, so I'll finish my thought. This is why it sucks to play against people like No Regret who do builds like this. Super early speed. Expand. You know, Ling Aggression. And this is very, very uncommon because look at this. He's on 14 drones. It's very low for 330 in the game. And he just now started his second queen. And this expansion, of course, was a bit later than if he had gone hatchery first, so... He did sacrifice things to do this, it's not like some imbalance rush or something. But No Regret really likes to pull in to his little bag of tricks and throw in these cheesy builds. If you don't know what this portrait is, and I know that this is like a, a clan thing, it's not his official portrait, but this is the Dark Voice. And you have to win an insane amount of games to get the Dark Voice portrait. It's like one of the hardest in the game to get, so... That was the game. Masa loses a very quick game. And this is one of these cheese builds that just completely counters what's standard. So if you enjoyed it, subscribe for more.